Now here I've got this little book of the tourist information with a temple on it. Of course it's a Freemason book. No doubt. So this Templar here, his name is Bourgandion. Apparently even existed. And um, he's telling the story here, you see? And uh, he's on every page. Here is a guy called Set On. He was a, um, a, a nobleman. Set, he's the, world, the god of the underworld, and On, Set On. Satan. It's a pharaonic name. You see, the aristocracy, they are the pharaohs. Yeah. A little Freemason book. Well, here's the bloke again, yeah. And, uh, yeah, here yeah, I showed you. Three and four. This is what it means. And the, the hand is the New World's Order. And the red... The, it's the old world's order, the original pharaohs or the original aristocracy. And it's all in the symbolics, in the symbology. There he is again, told this story, Freemason story. Templars. I just made it to a nice lake here. It's called Lake uh, Lac de Saint Croix, the Lake of the Holy Cross. Oh, the Holy Cross Lake. Just go to the other side. There are not too many tourists yet. Nice mountains overhead. So, yeah. I climbed the way up here through the Maquis. It's quite, no, it's not easy. It's not really a path here. No, it's at least a nice view of the lake here. The Lake of the Holy Cross. But you have to be careful here in this region, they've got these little snakes, vipers, you know, they're about 20 centimeters long, called Espic. And they're deadly. They're dead within an hour. Now, if you are a revolutionary, or just even traveling, never take the easy way. You know, if you sleep like here, like on the beach here, you'll, you'll be woken up, you know, like people say it's forbidden, police come, security, uh, or whatever, criminals, you know, so always do the long way. I went up here, you know, through the bush here, but I couldn't find a flat place here, so I finally put it here. So. See, always take the uneasy places. Don't go and sleep where the people are. You won't sleep good. They woke you, wake you up in the night, you know. And I know here nobody is coming. If I sleep there, I might suspect loads of people coming. And not really the ones I'd like to meet in the middle of the night. But here, who would come here, you know, in the bush here? There's snakes here, there's tiny little vipers and aspects. So nobody would come here. It's the same like in a revolution, you know, or a war. If you find an easy way out solution, don't take it. It'd go wrong. You know, if you're like hesitating, oh yeah, it's easy, I win the war, you know, or it, it, it'll avoid me like a uh, hundred kilometers uh, hiking, you know, or a stiff walk. Don't do it. Take the long way, you know, where nobody goes like, and, uh, which is unexpected, yeah. So last night I slept there in the bushes. There's Lac de Saint Croix in the south of France. Go down the river. I oh, see, there you go, I knew it. I knew it beforehand. Camping is only for the rich if you come with a camping car, like, you know, and you can do it. Not for the pool with the tent. So I knew it, so... It's also a matter of uh, money. I think that's a camping place there, you know, there. And they want to make money, you know. So the best place to hide out in the, in the mountains, you know. Well, who's gonna, they don't, you know, they want to sit in front of the telly in, in the evening. Nobody's gonna search for you in the evening. 
Come on, get out of here. Forbidden. Unauthorized camping forbidden. Well, I had a nice night, mate. Don't worry. It's the first time people died in 10 years. Jumping from this bridge. wondering what is this a grave or something a water why uh -huh. then I got the answer where is it now there's somewhere a um, a hunter's lodge somewhere here I can't see it now well anyway it's there in the bush somewhere is a hunter's lodge so there it is it's very smart so the hunter just waits until the animal comes drink and then bang. You know, it was somewhere there in the bush there. I'm trying to find a place to sleep but it's, nothing works. Pharaoh in a place called uh, Le Palu, Le Palo, I don't remember. So I'm here in the French Grand Canyon here and it's called uh, La Gorge du Verdon. It's going to that lake where I was before. And here the Templars were hiding as well. And in a place called uh, Trigans. I'm going there. You hear, you hear the word tri, which is tr three or trois, like Isis, Horus and Seth. That's where they were believing. So I'm going there for you. Nice, isn't it? So again, this is the French Grand Canyon. Templars have been hiding out here as well. And uh, I try and show it to you. It's going, it's very long. It's going all the way through there and on the other side as well. That way it's going to that lake. And this one is going very, very far. You can see it's going through here. Uh, Le Gorge de Verdun. Beautiful. I had a nice, it's April. I had a nice, dip in the in the pool so here's one this is the deadly snake here it's called an aspic you see how small they are and this is that typical if you if you look at you know it's still fresh you know it's still bleeding here's the poison light coming out it's a typical skin of the uh, laspic and on the other side of the head I don't want to like pick it up or maybe uh, wait a minute so I tried to pick it up, but it's still fresh. I can't, you know. And uh, on the other side of its head, it's got a Templar's V on it. So this is, you see how tiny it is? Well, it kills you. Aspic. And they got a bigger one, it's called the Viper. Or in English, I think it's an Adder. So, that's excellent here. It's quite hard, you know, the, uh, the path. Uh, you see, it's all the way going there. Beautiful, Le Verdon, if you ever get the chance to do so. So I'm here with my backpack. And I'm doing, I've got like three, five kilos on my neck. <laughs> I'm doing it on my sandals, yeah. I got the cheapest I could get in the China shop, like for 12 dollars, 12 euros. Well, they hold. I go into the water with them, I don't have any dirty socks, my feet stay dry as you can see, so I don't get any blisters, the soles are very flat so I don't twist my feet. Uh, it's excellent, why buy $300 shoes, get out of here, get out of here. And there are vultures in here as well, uh, maybe eagles, wolves too, wolves. Yeah. And Templars hiding here as well. Oh, you can walk here for days and days, you know, to get through it and don't see the end yet. Uh, it's amazing. Nice hideout there for the Templar boys. And uh, amazing. It's the 
French Canyon. One of the, there are more French Canyons. This is called La Gorge du Verdon. Gorge, like the word gorgeous. <laughs> A lot of caves here. So it says uh, you have to wear walking shoes, it's forbidden to go on anything else. <laughs> Difficult or dangerous stretches ahead for the next 10 kilometers. So I'm just I'm walking like this here. We say uh, Auberge de Cavalier, Carrefour de Cavalier. That's the, uh, the knights, the crossing of the knights. So I'm going up here. So uh, it's forbidden without walking shoes. Hello. Are you okay? No, I'm fine, yeah. Yeah, and you? Yeah, yeah, I'm good, yeah. Oh, so let's go then. Good. Looks fine. Probably good. <laughs> so there's like little forests like around, you know. Probably full of snakes, uh, caves, Templar's treasures. That's a big cave there. Where is it? Uh, oh, I can't see it. Oh. You see it yourself. Oh, it's really steep. Mm. There's even some beaches here next to the river. Well, you better not sleep here, you know, but you can see here the water can rise up in the night, like you never know. Ah. You see all those branches up in the tree? Now that means this high the water gets. If it starts raining. There too, all these you know, little things there in the tree. Here too, this high it gets. If you're sleeping here, well, you're like uh, a meter underwater. <laughs> yeah. So what's that here? Yeah. What's that? Interesting. Templars. Okay, now I see where you're getting it. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. You good? <laughs> Yo! Whoa, that's like sort of steep here. Dive, dive bombers. So what do you say, you like the French Grand Canyon? Oh, there's no end to it. I'm walking and walking and walking and walking. An impressive staircase, like jaw dropping. <laughs> yeah, that's a vulture. Pretty big, huh?
uh, when Arte has to pass it through a couple of long tunnels. Uh, Ages. Like the Middle Ages here. So here it says private property, respect the plants and the um, and the nature. Well, that's what I did. It didn't say forbidden, did it? So beautiful here, you know. So I already slept here three nights. There's the briefcase. So thank you. Here's a train of caterpillars. They're very dangerous. You go near them or they throw like arrows into your skin and you don't get rid of them. I hope they're on it because you know with the sun I uh yeah. There, I think there, yeah, there's a whole bunch of them. Don't go near to them. They're all over in the trees as well. They're as dangerous as ticks and snakes and, you know, uh, I think there it is. Uh, they got their nests like, it. oh, there it is, I think. Can't see it very well in the, uh, on the LCD. Yeah. It's a real plague. So well, there's another Templar's flag here, looks like on the Swiss army knife. I don't know if it's red or black. If it's black, it would be the Teutonic Knights. So I'm here in Trigans. There should be another Templar stuff here going on here. And if we look at the coat of arms here, of Trigans, you see, there's the hidden hand of the Freemasons in it. It's the, even the right hand. The hand that hides, you know, and it's white, which is the Upper Egypt, the White House. Red are the original, was the original kingdom, so way they were infiltrating, like, with the, with the white hand, the original kingdom. There are th three black stripes, that's the, uh, uh, the, um, the compass, number three, and four, that's also three in the name, Trigans, three. And four yellow stripes for the uh, the base of the pyramids. All together, it's seven, like the G. So actually, in other name, in other words, the G of the Templars is here, number seven, three and four. And four is the um, uh, um, yeah, we well, you know the, the 90 degrees. So again, there was a bit of noise. So four is the uh, the square, yeah. It's all in it, and they know what they're doing, yeah. So three and four, square and compass, as I've shown you before. So, so it says, Guardian, the guardians of Du Verdon, which is this, uh, where I was hiking there, you know, the river in the canyon. Absolutely, Templars. Well, let's go and have a look, but it's not the commander, eh? So this restaurant, you know, it's of course it's a Freemason restaurant. Freemasons, they make, they do an oath uh, uh, to the Templars, uh, to be loyal to the Templars. The same colours as the. Uh, the mask of Tutankhamun, gold and lapis lazuli, yeah. controlling the valley as always. Yeah. Now look, this is a typical Freemason uh, restaurant where they do their parties. Uh.
Fleur de Lis. This is what Pharaoh likes to come, you know. Yeah, they got a feeling like they're ruling the world. Look, they're ruling the world. That's what they do. They're ruling the world. So where I'm gonna put my tent? Yo, a soccer place. Yeah, that's nice. They got a nice lawn, like in the corner there. Nobody sees me. And I stand up early. That's where I'm gonna sleep. So, yeah. I got my uh, itinerary all set up. That's the river. Beautiful. Looks like another castle there, but the bloke said it's a mountain. Wow. Wow. Well, he must know it because he got a Fleur de Lis restaurant here. So. Mm -hmm. So this castle is not a real castle, a uh, Templar's castle, but now it is, so to speak, because the Freemasons come out of the castle and it belongs to them now. Um, they show this in the brochure. Um, they honestly say this is not a Templar's castle. And uh, the other castles I showed you, they were real Templar's castles. The, um, I don't know, two or three. Creu le Bain, Montfort, and uh, yeah. Oh, it sounds like a real Templar's castle, <laughs> but it isn't. But the Templar's commandery is right next to it here, five minutes by car. Freemasons. Templars. Same thing. Ah, oh, here it is. Commandery of Saint Meme. There is the commandery. And here was the hand. Pharaoh, the Freemason restaurant. Me. Sporting place. Nobody there. It's Eastern. So whenever you go to France, just don't go to Paris. Just skip it. Don't go to Nice. All these big cities. A lot of nasty people. Terrorist attacks. This is France. Quiet. Beautiful. A lot of fantastic landscapes. 24% of the of the country is forest. The rest, it's all countryside. They're all heaped up in some big cities. Go and see the Eiffel Tower on YouTube or on, on the internet, on Wikipedia. It's not worth it. It's just not worth it. Don't do as all the others do. Don't, don't jump the bandwagon, eh? This is France. Paris is not France. I don't know. Mediterranean is not France. So let's have a look at the commandery of Saint Meme. One and a half case. I suppose that's the Templar's commandery I'm going to have a look at. Yeah. Oh, yes, that's the commandery. It even says the... Uh, where it is. So... So this here is an old temple 
of the Templars. In, uh, a, uh, a little Templars church. Uh, now they put the uh, the sheep are in it. You see how it's round here? Well, you wouldn't put a, uh, a stables, you wouldn't make that round, eh? Like this was a church, a Templars church. And it's from the 11th century. Very old. Yeah. Interesting. So now we've got the Templar sheep. Right? Well, that's we actually. We are the the, the human beings, like the, uh, the the civil population. We are the sheep of the Templars. Right? I don't know what that is. And uh, yeah. what was that? It's from the 11th century. Temple of the Templars. So this is the Temple of Saint Mem. See how it's round here on one side? Simple temple. You wouldn't, you wouldn't make any stables like that, eh? This is very old. Pyramid. So no use making the pigsty round like that, eh? Yeah. I'm not sure about the other houses here. Uh, yeah, there's an artist living here. Train, the train gang, the caterpillars going to the next tree, just crossing the road from these trees here, yeah. going to the other side and infested here. They're very dangerous. Old French car, fantastic. <laughs> hey, just, just hit the brakes, eh? Must be a chapel of the Templars then. Let's go and take the New World's Order, yeah? Those Templars, let's get rid of them. Okay. Last night I got invited by an old Frenchman here, he was doing like political activities like in the night, like nocturnal. Uh, nobody should really see it apparently. <laughs> so, so I just spent here the night, very nice. And interesting, interestingly enough, he showed me this book here about the, uh, the Templars in the region. Uh, what did I read in it? The Intrigants, uh, where I've just filmed that, that castle for you. Yeah. In, uh, Intrigants. There. You know, you remember that with the um, uh, the Freemason chairs and all that. Well, the Templars were there. Actually, they were there. Uh, you remember the village, like on the hill where I slept there? Well, that's it. Trigans. Another interesting thing is that the one, the Templars castle I already filmed for you, like a couple of months back. Uh, the Rue. You know, with all the, the cameras there, and was probably one of the most important in in the region, the entire France. And the name here, Rue, um, or Rio, Rue, mostly said Rue, it sounds like what the uh, US Rangers say, you know, in French you say, you say no, like Rue. So, in English, that would be like Rue or Hua, 
you know, like the US Rangers. Hua. So that's like, uh, you know, obedience to the Templars, to the Templar order. <laughs> all military, all police, all authorities, it's all Templar New World Order thing anyway, you know. Of the, um, and the White House was the, um, they, of the pharaohs, they were the New World Order pharaohs, and the Red House, the original pharaohs, and, and you know, Upper Egypt, uh, Lower Egypt. Okay, interesting book. So it was indeed a Templar's castle with that uh, Teutonic Knights um, flag on it. Sorry for that. So this is a Templar's cross here on this church here. But this is not a Templar's church. The real Templar's church is here. There it is. And there was also commandery here in uh, in Cons. Uh, Sur Artuby. So let's go and have a look. Le Templier, the Templars. Monte de Templier, the hill to the Templars. Or mounting. Uh, here the Fleur de Lis with there the red original Old World Order. Pharaohs of the firstborn son. Well, a little bit of wind, please. Oh, never mind. So, let's go. So, there it is. Another Templars church, original. And again, the Templars, they were no pious monks, but they were aristocrats. And the only, there were only three things in the Middle Ages, the people, the church, and the, uh, and the king, the court. So, you could, they couldn't hide, as they were aristocrats, they couldn't hide behind, amongst the people. <laughs> of course, not amongst, uh, in the court, at the court, in the castle. So the only thing left was to hide. Like uh, in a church, you know, the uh, ecclesiastic uh, orders. And that's why they are the Templars, but they're all aristocrats, you see. Just lying, like today they're their descendants, the Freemasons. Very strategic for a church, ain't it now? Eh? You could almost say it's something else. But here I see another chapel. To me, this looks more like a Templar's chapel here. You know, there's a lot of misleading information, you know. I'm gonna have a look there. I think this is the one. Anyway, this is very old anyway. And they all say like uh, tourist stuff, you know, this is the the Templar's Chapel in uh, uh, in this place here. Excellent, this looks more like it, eh? Yeah, 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 and it's uh, from the. This one is even older. They just told me. Yeah. A shooting hole for a church. Eh? There's the other one. You know, on top of it, apparently this is this is what the uh, the, uh, the viper snakes are what they got on the back of their heads. You know. That's what they like. That's what they were. These vipers, liars, cheetahs. There's some uh, archaeological sites there. There. Let's see. there. Let's see what the archaeological sites. Probably that's what's that's where the commandery uh, commandery was. So you can see this one is much older. You know. It's a typical round thing, you know, with, uh, at, as in the pigsty. Uh, ah, yeah. And you say it's a, it's a chapel of Saint, Saint John. Saint John. And here it says the hospitalers. Yeah, uh, they must have been here. Yeah, oh, probably both. Well, let's say, let's, you know, I, I don't really care. Let's say they're both Templar's churches, right? So this one is even older. 
and this is dedicated to uh, Saint John, you know, like uh, Saint Jean d'Arc. Well, it must be Templars. So here's the name of the place, Col sur Arthur. Arthur. Templars. So I'm back here, so I confirm once more, I read in the book, this is a real Templars castle. The Templars were here. It wasn't built by the Templars, but they were here for a long time. Okay. Look, they announced snow for tonight and tomorrow. Well, it's still a thousand meters high here, you know. Typical snow, like... Sometimes it's more yellow, you know, for the snow, like in this time of the year. So, yeah. What do you think? Snow? Well, I don't mind. What about you? Nah, it's okay with me. The enemy. Pharaoh. Pharaoh. They're slaves. And the castle from the other side. So this here is the castle of Valcross. Cross it's most is probably from the word cross. Crooks in Latin or Koth in Spanish like you know it's forbidden so they most probably stopped me but so I tell you now there are a lot of rumors about this there was a Polish guy in 1945 or 1944 uh, most probably an aristocrat anyway upper class authority guy and he found papers like in a castle that the uh, the Templars hid the um, the Ark of the Covenant here and the Templars after way they were in the uh, the Haute Provence uh, where I filmed before they went to the Verdun and they hid they were already running that was uh, in 1308 so one year after they got all arrested in uh, uh, yeah in France you know by uh, Philip uh, the Fair I don't want to cross here the uh, it's full of snakes here. They got poisonous snakes here, so I, I would have crossed it. But I got only, you know, got only my my convertibles on, <laughs> so I have to take the road here. I, I really don't feel like going through this here, and uh, on my on my convertibles, and uh, yeah. But most probably the SS Annenerbe, they they must have passed here. But, you know, the treasure, they went directly over Italy, Albenga, where I filmed you, over the Via Templare, went directly to Switzerland. They didn't dare to go overland. They took the ships, you know, bring it directly to Switzerland, only the last bit on the land. And, um, but there are other things like manuscripts, and they were, they were, well, considered to be real treasures and here in, uh, hidden all over, you know. Uh, where is it now? Yeah, there it is. Uh, yeah. So well, let's have a look then, eh? Yeah. So while well, I'm going through the bloody grass anyway, be careful. Because there's another house there, you know, so... Uh, well, never mind. Snakey, snakey. Hello, you scared of snakeys? Oh, yes, I am. I want to run, you know? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is what I actually always do, never go in through the main gate, you know, just infiltrate in large circles from the back, make smaller circles, so if they get you, at least you've got some stuff on your hard disk. Uh, so, the castle is there, you see the area, it's magnificent, yeah, the Haute Provence, Le Verdon. So I'm still infiltrating. I have a very, I feel things, and I have a very bad feeling here. They do ugly things here. So I always 
infiltrate through large circles and then go out through the front end and say, hello, here I am. I'm so happy to see you. How are you doing, you know? Sun worship. Where is it? Oh. I guess I'll some extra trade. Take the road. Get out of here. I don't like it at all. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just take the colors there. Pharaohs. Bye bye Pharaoh. So a good thing I took the snake path. Now I get out from the place where they apparently are really living. Oh you know. Nobody hears the children cry here. Oh what do you know? Three stones for Isis, Horus and Seth. And some I don't know what it is, sort of a circle here from black magic, you know, I don't know. And the castle. Some more shit going on, just like in the. Uh, see that one? Uh, there it is. Somewhere. Oh, I don't see that. Uh, that was there. The pole. Yeah, that was a pole. And through it. Oh, there it is. I can't see it. It focuses on the in on the trees. Oh, there's the other house. So. Hello, you all right? Even this one is three. See this one here? Uh, yeah. It's also three. Eyes is Horace and Seth. Well, they know what they're doing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, look, there's the pyramid with the capstone with the, with the ball on it. I just talked to the guy, you know, he would have stopped me if I go, so I can't focus in really, I'm, otherwise he'd see it. Hey Swissy, what you want? Your time is up, you know, you're finished. So get out of my way, Swissy.